In this video, we'll be doing list 2, sum 67 in Python. The prompt is return the sum of the numbers in the array except ignore sections of the numbers starting with a 6 and extending to the next 7. Every 6 will be followed by at least one 7. Return 0 for no numbers. So basically what we're going to do here is, as you can see here, it's, this is going to do 1 plus 2 plus 2. And it's going to ignore all these values since it's between a 6 and a 7. So it's just going to return 5. And same here, it's going to do 1, 2, and then the 6, 7. Since there's nothing in between, so this doesn't really matter, but we don't include the 6 and the 7. So it'll be 1, 2, plus 2. 1 plus 2 plus 2, two or 1 plus 1 plus 2. We're just going to return 4. And so basically what we're going to do here is I'm going to do uh, a Boolean variable to see if uh, if the numbers are in between 6. So first I'm going to do a sum value to store our answer. Sum equals 0. Then we're going to do is between is equal to false since uh, initially we do not know if the number is going to be 6 right here. Um, right, So we're going to have to change that later on. Then we're going to do make a for loop. So we're going to do for i in range len of nums if nums i equals 6 is between equals true. And then we're going to do uh, another statement if not find so it, if not uh, is between so basically if it's a uh, if it's not between six or, or six or seven then we're going to do sum plus equals nums bracket i since we're going to be able to add it since it's not between a six or a seven right and then we're going to do if nums bracket i is seven and is between, then we're going to do is between equals false. So basically what it's going to do is uh, it's going to say that if uh, if the number that it's on right now is 7 and also is between is true, then it's going to make the number false since it's going to be breaking out of the, since it's not going to be between anymore after that value. So then we're going to get out of the for loop and the if statements and we're going to just return the sum. Uh, and with this, you should get the correct answer. So basically, uh, you're checking if the number is between 6. And so if it's a 6, if it gets to the number 6, then it's going to not add anything in between it until it gets to the 7. Then after the 7, it's going to start adding stuff again. And uh, then you just add uh, the sum, add to the sum like this. And then you just return, the, return that value of the sum. And that's how you get the answer. Thank you very much for watching.